I'm here with Miss Davis's fifth grade class and they have the chance to go to Yellowstone. However, they're going to need the community's help first. Yellowstone! This is Sorrell Davis's first year teaching fifth grade. However, she knows these students quite well as she used to be their third grade teacher. Yep, and we're back together and I could not be more happy. I'm really honored to be their teacher. Expedition Yellowstone used to be a staple at Irving Elementary School. However, after COVID, it went away. This year, Davis was shocked when her students got chosen to go. And I thought, great, we'll try, but we're going to be at the Lamar Valley, and there is no way we're going to get it. And we did all the paperwork, and Ranger Michael responded saying, we have an opening, November 8th through 11th. However, this dream might not be a reality for some of these students. 11 students in this classroom that even how close Yellowstone is, they do not have the means to get there. Despite the pushback, these students are excited to get the chance to go. For fifth grader Elion, when hearing the news... Me and my friend Dwayne, mostly all of my friends, we were uh, uh, hugging each other and like jumping around and stuff. Most importantly, all of the kids are excited about the wildlife. Probably grizzly bear and wolf. I hope I can see some wolves there. I feel like that would be pretty cool. I would want to see a beaver. Um, probably a wolf. Probably a fox. Before these kids can go and see some animals, Davis is urging the community to help. The biggest need is um, financial assistance. Being at a Title I school, we have some financial barriers that we need to work through. Davis is looking for scholarship funding and winter coats and sleeping bags. People who see what a valuable experience this can be for the children of Bozeman. Her bottom line? And these children have an opportunity to go and experience this and see how they can set dreams, they can think bigger than their small community around them. If you would like to help these kids go to Yellowstone, visit our website. In Bozeman, Megan Elaine, MTN News.